So I got off work yesterday and took a trip down to the Burbank Card Show. Really cool show. Uh, for those of you who don't know, it's pretty much the biggest uh, card show on the West Coast. Kind of rivals like the National or something like that. Um, super, super big. Uh, it's down at the Anaheim Convention Center. Um, I had a great time down there. I just wanted to share a video with you guys about some of the things I saw and what I did and maybe a few of the things I picked up. So let's take a look at the uh, event. <music> So the show was really great. It was packed. Uh, there was a ton of different tables there. I mean, just there was wall to wall vendors. Um, there was a lot of like wax. Um, there was a whole bunch of different like individual cards. There was a lot of just great stuff, vintage, new. Um, it was really, really a good show. Um, I was able to look at a bunch of different things that I was, I was trying to pick up for the show. Um, I didn't find everything, but there was quite a bit of stuff that was there. I made quite a few good deals. Um, I was actually searching for Hammy, wanted an Aaron Jones card, couldn't find it. There was a lot of the major companies there. I mean, everything from Fanatics to Beckett. We had PSA, I think, was there. Um, I also stumbled across the tag grading booth. It was pretty cool. They were uh, doing custom cards and slabbing them for people. Pretty awesome. Um, Ultra Pro was there. What's up guys, Honored Athlete here, world leader in collegiate licensed trading cards. Come check us out, we got all kinds of cards here you can see. Everything's licensed by the university, we do men's and women's sports. It's just a great way to partner with student athletes in the NIL, so come check us out. So I'm here with Craig and we're going to rip a mystery pack for him today, see what we get. Let's see here. Alright, looks like we're going to have some NC State football. We got Trevile Price, Rico Jackson. Oh, that looks like a Shaheen battle. I'm thinking maybe an autograph. Holy cow, that's gonna be an on-card auto for Shaheen battle. 67 out of 150 on that. We got a Brady Rosner and a Blake Raphael on those packs, guys. Sick yeah. on-card autos. Only place you can find the on-card autos on the app. Come on, guys, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So I wanted to share with you guys some of the stuff I picked up at the show. Um, on it was cool enough to give me a couple more packs to rip. So I brought a couple of these back from the show. So we'll open these up and let's see what we were able to pull from these. Pretty cool company. These are just the random packs that they had from the show. So there's no telling what sport or athlete it is. Cool. Tyler Knack. Quentin Newsom, all well, Nebraska guys, Sam Sledge, McHenrick, Cooper Hausman, Chubba Purdy, and Billy Kemp. And this other pack, thought it was pretty cool for them to hook me up with a couple packs, take home and rip. Looks like Texas, uh, Robert Sweeney, Reed Malfers, Paxton Anderson, Anthony Hill Jr., Alfred Collins. Oh, that's cool. Uh, on card auto, 62 out of 300. It's on like a cracked ice. It's cool. And then the Alfred Collins card and Aaron Bryant. So that's pretty cool. Picked up a couple autos from those guys. Um, you know me, I can't keep away from the vintage, so I did pick up a lot of vintage stuff. There was so much stuff out there, it was pretty cool. Um, I did grab this 58 uh, Ollie Matson. I had to have this card. Been working on my Hall of Fame collection, so this was a cool one I wanted to pick up. Uh, I grabbed Joe Green Rookie. Just saw it at a cool price, and I wanted one for the collection. Grabbed a couple of Gale Sayers cards. You gotta love Gale Sayers, man. I'm gonna have all of these, but I have picked these up because I have an idea for some future giveaway stuff. So I grabbed those. 
Um, I picked up an Allen Page. You know, I like the Purple People Eaters, one of the greatest defense of all time. And since there was Vikings there, I went ahead and grabbed a Fran Tarkenton. Just a later Fran Tarkenton, nothing big. But I didn't have this one in my collection, so I grabbed that. Grabbed a Warren Moon rookie. Thought that was a sweet card. It was in really, really good shape, so might even grade that one. Definitely cool to have. Picked up some more Montana stuff. Um, just a couple of randoms. I also still have the Montana giveaway. That's going to be on next Sunday, which will be... Next Sunday is... Oh, you know, it's going to be next Sunday. So grab those two Montana cards. Grab the Jerry Rice second year just to go with my rookie I have. That was kind of cool. And saw a Marcus Allen rookie that was cheap. Uh, the only newer stuff I got, I did grab this Tyreek Hill. It's pretty cool. I needed a Tyreek Hill rookie, so I'll grab this Optic. And then, of course, the other auto I got from On It. There, um, I picked up a couple graded cards. Um, just grabbed a Montana. It's only a seven, but I, it was a cool cheap slab, and I wanted to throw it in my Montana collection. Grabbed this Larry Fitzgerald rookie. It's a nine. But it was just cool. I mean, Larry Fitzgerald is completely awesome. So I had to grab that. Just some cool deals that I found on some cards that, you know. I also grabbed this Troy Aikman rookie. It's a it's only an eight, but you know, it's Troy Aikman, so why not keep that in the collection? And then the card that I was after that I found was this uh 1960 Jim Brown. It's just such a good looking card. It's in, it's really centered, so it shows real well. It's only a PSA 4, but I just wanted it for, for the wall, for my Hall of Fame collection. That's why it's a 4. It's a little off-centered on the back. But I figured, you know what, it shows well. It's pretty centered on the front. I was really stoked to get that. Um, like I mentioned, the uh, tag grading booth was doing custom cards and slabbing them up. I thought it was cool. I got this one made. It's got the Burbank Card Show logo in it and the tag. and Just a cool card. And they were slabbing them, so I said, why not? Thought it was a pretty cool idea. I was real stoked to grab that. And while I was at it, they were super cool. And they slabbed up one of my cards that I signed. So I just thought that was cool of them to do that. Really a um, pretty cool thing. I was just stoked to have these two cards. Just to have. I don't know. So shout out to Tag for, for being there and doing this cool promo. It was cool that they did that. I was, I was stoked. But yeah, I mean, this is kind of what I picked up. Um, Just a bunch of stuff for the PC. You know, I just found some good deals. It's tough to find vintage stuff. So when I get to some shows that have a lot of it, I always go nuts on the vintage. But, you know, this Jim Brown card is just super, super cool. You know, I, I don't have his rookie. I'm, I'm, going after that so I'll have to settle for for this but it's a great looking card and then just you know Joe Green I mean come on anytime you grab Hall of Famers you need to jump on that one of these days these people are going to realize that the vintage stuff is no joke so you know just a cool little haul um, also I'm going to be going to another card show I, I met up with the uh, people from Front Row Card Show while I was there um, they're going to be doing a show in Pasadena which isn't too far from me uh, they were nice enough to comp me a couple tickets to the show. So I'm definitely going to go check that out. Um, it looks like that's going to be September 7th and 8th. So I'll see if I can put together a cool video for you guys on that. Check out that show and what I pick up from there. But uh, I mean, other than that, I just had a great time at the show. Um, I'll put a link in the description for the... Actually, at the end scene, I'll put a link for the video where you can go get the chance to win that Joe Montana auto. So I'll be giving away the Joe Montana. It's going to be September 1st. It's going to be the next Sunday. Um, today is the 25th. So August, or September 1st, we'll go ahead and be giving away the Joe Montana auto. So if you click on the, the video that's going to be in the end screen, um, you can go ahead and get yourself registered to win that. But I appreciate you guys watching the video and... Uh, Hopefully you guys will subscribe.